It's summer, ladies, and I'm guessing you want to wear something stylish yet comfortable and cool. A great option is to wear shorts. <gasps> shorts? Yes, even for us ladies over 50s, ladies, there are ways and means. To find out how, stay tuned to this video. My channel to all ladies over 50 who want to look and feel fabulous and a special warm welcome if you're new here. So today I'm really excited to be sharing some style tips for us ladies over 50 to consider when we choose shorts. How to choose them, which shorts to choose and how to wear them in both a casual and a dressier way. So if this sounds good for you please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss any of my weekly videos. And don't forget that I list all the items that I wear in the video in the video description if you scroll down under the video so that you can shop them. Now that it's summer, you may be looking for a comfortable yet classy look that keeps you cool in the summer days. And shorts are a perfect option. <gasps> shorts, I hear you say. Yes, there are ways and means of wearing shorts. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to do that. If you choose the right shorts, even if you're worried about, uh, self-conscious about perhaps your legs or your knees, um, or you don't want to wear anything too short, I'm gonna show you how you can do that with perfect solutions. So if you're still worried about wearing shorts, my last outfit will give you the perfect option, which I know you're going to love, guarantee it. And so don't forget to watch to the end to catch that. So let's jump right in and get started. I'm going to give you six style tips and then I'm going to give you outfits that demonstrate those tips in action, as it were. Style tip number one, don't wear shorts that are really short. The worst thing you can do is to wear shorts that are really short shorts. It's a major fashion faux pas. You'll feel self-conscious and you'll feel uncomfortable in it. Even, you know, when you're a young girl of 18, let's say, to have your buttocks hanging out of the back of your shorts is not a good look. It's not classy, it's not elegant, and it's definitely not for us. Instead, you need to wear shorts that have a little bit more length in the leg. Choose shorts that have an inseam of at least three to five inches. So this is much more flattering, much more elegant, and they're still shorts. Outfit number one, I'm going to show you that will illustrate this. Okay, so outfit number one. You'll see here that I'm wearing dark indigo shorts. These also are not that short, as I've said for this style tip. Uh, these in fact have, I think, a three and a half inch inseam. They may look a little bit longer on me because I'm quite short. Um, they are not only a little bit longer and therefore flattering length, but they're also darker. So they're quite slimming as well. They're also high-waisted, really high-waisted, these ones. I got them from Sasanda. Um, I will put the link in the uh, descriptions below this video, as I do with all of my clothes. But these are particularly good because being high-rise, as they call them, um, they pull in your stomach, make it look flatter, pull everything in, um, as well, as I said, of being a little bit longer. Now, as you can see here, what I've teamed it with is a beautiful white fresh shirt. Now, this is lovely because it's chic, it's cool, it's a classic look. You can't go wrong with it. Uh, you can dress it up or dress it down. It's fresh and it's cool and it's comfortable. So this is a lovely look that will take you anywhere. As I said, you can dress it up or down. Style tip number two, don't wear high heels with shorts. Now you can wear low heels, maybe up to two inches or flats or little ballerinas or flip flops. They all look great because of the balance of the outfit. But if you start wearing really high heels, that looks like you're trying too hard. It's too contrived and it does look a little bit tarty. So you can see this is the same outfit that I was wearing just now. Um, you can see these beautiful shoes I've got. These are Steve Madden. They are, they add interest to a very classic outfit. So they're a little bit metallic. This is sort of silvery metallic and they just shine from a distance. They're very comfortable. They're flat except for something like that, a heel at the back. So basically flat, but I'm absolutely in love with them and they go with everything. Style tip number three. Select shorts that are slightly too big. Basically size up slightly in the shorts. 
Now you can see in the outfit that I've got here, these are Sassanda white shorts, uh, same company obviously, but these are the white versions. Again, I put the link below. They are incredibly comfortable. Why? Because I've sized up slightly. Now, why do this? Well, because firstly, if it's warm, you don't want something really tight around you. And secondly, they look classier and they look more chic if they're slightly looser. The worst thing you can do to try to look a bit fatter than you actually are is to wear shorts that are too tight because it looks like you're squeezed into them. So also you can see on these shorts, not only around the top and around the bottom, you must make sure that they're slightly larger, but also make sure that there's plenty of material between your leg and the shorts at the bottom. Why also? Because that doesn't make it look like you've got fat legs. You actually look thinner that way. So let's go back to this outfit that I'm wearing now with the white shorts to show you my style tip number four, which is balance your look. What I mean by that is if you're wearing shorts or something that's quite tight on one part of your body, make sure you balance it by wearing something slightly looser, slightly more relaxed on the other part of your body. It just gives your silhouette more structure. So here you can see I'm wearing this absolutely lovely little blue um, off the shoulder top. Now I got this some time ago in France actually, but I've linked below of similar ones um, for you to have a look at. Now, if you're wearing shorts, obviously you've got a lot of leg showing. Now, what you don't want to therefore do is show a lot of skin at the top as well. So this off the shoulder option is just perfect. Shows a little touch of skin, but not too much. It's tantalizingly sexy and totally appropriate for our age group. So you'll also see that the shorts add structure here, even though the top is, is looser and more flowing. Now, the important thing to bear in mind if you're going to wear a looser and um, top that's more relaxed is tuck at least half of it in. You can see here that I've tucked half of it in at the front and the rest of it is out. That gives it a more structured silhouette, gives you shape. Now, I just love a pair of white shorts. They are, for me, a wardrobe essential, a basic staple for the summer. Also, the reason for this is because you can put anything with them. As I said, you can dress them up, dress them down. They're incredibly versatile. In this next outfit, you can see that I put another pop of colour, a solid pop of, co pop of colour, pop of colour, pop of colour, which is mustard colour, mustard yellow, which is another beautiful shade for the summer. And it's not too tight. It's summery, but it's not really revealing. Um, but it just is a lovely contrast with the white. And also in both of these outfits with the white shorts, I'm wearing a lovely little chain belt. Now they're really on trend. They add interest to the outfit as well. Um, as I said, this one is, is a little bit old, but I've linked a very similar one below that you can have a look at. And I'm wearing the same Steve Madden shoes, which as I said, they just go with everything particularly beautiful with shorts. Style tip number five. If you want to look a little dressier in shorts, ramp up your outfit by adding a light blazer or a very light cotton jacket. This is brilliant for ramping it up and making it look a little bit dressier, a little bit smarter. Other elements that you can add to do that are also adding jewellery, um, adding a hat, as you can see in this next outfit that I'm going to show you, um, and a belt and some shiny glamorous shoes. So to illustrate style tip number five, um, have a look at this little outfit that I'm wearing now. I've got gone back to the darker shorts, the indigo blue shorts, and I've teamed that with just a plain white vest top. But over the top, I've put a very fine striped, very light little cotton blazer or jacket. And this just, as I said, it just ramps it up to make it look more, more dressy. Um, it can take you perhaps shopping or lunch with friends. And I've added a few little extras like the belt. The belt is actually an imitation Hermes belt, but any white belt with a gold buckle, and I have linked a really good couple of really nice ones underneath, will do well here because it adds interest around your waist, gives you the structure, pulls you in, and I've included some lovely little gold uh, flats, which I have shown you in a video before, but they are, they're Zara and they've got that lovely chain on the top, but they're dead flat, dead comfortable. So the whole effect plus the hat um, looks quite chic. Now, ladies, here's the big one, as I promised. If you're still worried about wearing shorts, if you still know that you're going to feel self-conscious, here is the perfect secret solution for you. Style tip number six, wear shorts that are knee length. 
So you can see in the outfit I've got here, I'm wearing these gorgeous white knee length shorts. Now they're not too tight. Uh, they pull in beautifully because they're high rise. So your stomach looks flatter than it is, which is always a good thing. Um, and they stop just at, at the kneecap. So you don't have to worry about things that are too short. You don't have to worry about any knee sort of issues. Um, and they stop at a very flattering length for the leg. They stop at, the, at a very thin part of the leg on the knee. So that's always a good look. Um, I've also teamed them with this black top that I'm wearing here. Now, it's a little bit tighter, but actually the whole effect is a lovely silhouette. And it's got the monochrome look. So you can wear this with either flat shoes or these ones like I'm wearing here, which are barely there black sandals. Now, they, they haven't got much of a heel. They're about two inches. So that's just if you want to look a little bit uh, dressier. But same same look really will go for the flip flops. So this is actually the secret to wearing shorts confidently. So there you have it, ladies. Six great style tips and five outfits, which I hope have given you some inspiration. So I hope you really enjoyed the video. I'd love to hear your comments below where we can chat about them and enjoy your day. Have an amazing time. Lots of love. Bye.